guys another episode of Dom Trump fishing as you can see we're going fishing yesterday I went to make actually we're gonna stay up here real quick just to keep the good audio so yesterday I went fishing and the reason I went fishing yesterday was it was opener and I thought I'd make a really nice video on opener and whatnot so that's what I went to do let's just say last night when I got home to edit the video things did not go very well I got about halfway through editing the video and the uh, file may or may not that had all the video been clicked when I hit delete instead of deleting other stuff. Long story short, all that video is gone. But my, the moral of this story is that it is fishing opener. Uh, yeah, opener is upon us. So what does that mean? I can finally fish for the gosh darn bass that I've been waiting for and no longer crappies. Now yesterday I had a pretty good day. I only caught like, holy crap, it's so windy. I'll make the rest of this intro in a second. Okay, so it's a little bit quieter for a whole wind over here. But what I was like trying to say is, well, yesterday I had a pretty decent day. I went out and caught like 20, 25 bass, a couple northerns, and I ended up with 11 pounds, so there was really no monsters caught. It was simply a video to show you guys opener in my perspective and whatnot. So all that is done. But fishing opener is around, and it's time for you know bass fishing again. Finally, today's video will consist of me bass fishing. I'm on a lake that I'm really comfortable fishing. I should be able to catch some. I don't remember if I've ever fished this lake in like this early. Wow, hiccups. I don't remember if I've ever fished this lake this early in the season before. But what I do know is there's some pretty big fish in here, so I should be able to catch you know some decent weight for today. So make sure to stay tuned, I'll be switching over to Chessie right about now. And if you guys are new, like I said, there's going to be plenty of fishing videos, especially bass fishing made this year. I'm hoping for 100, so make sure to hit that subscribe button because, like I said, there's going to be a ton. But, without further ado, let's switch over to the Chessie. Right now, I want you guys to go down in the comments, guess my total weight in pounds, like the pound point, and then whatever decimal place closest to the correct answer will get a shout out in the next video. Without further ado, let's get into today's video. Peace. There also is an insanely high population of northerns in the lake I'm fishing today, so the odds of me catching one of those things are pretty high as well. Water temperature is 54 degrees today, which is the warmest water I could find yesterday. So I'm hoping that that means the fish are a little bit more active than they even were yesterday out on the other lake. There's something. Oh, I lost them. There's one. I don't know if it's a northern or a bass, but something bit it. I'm thinking northern. Yep. Boom. Ah, he was bleeding. Come on. There's one. This is a bass too. This is a decent bass actually. Let's go. He jumped for it. Just a toad, look at him. Not the like biggest for length wise, but he is fat. Oh, I'm sorry bud. Boom, look at that guy. He jumped for it. 189 is the total, well this guy is weight. Little chunky guy. Take it. There's one. 
about the same size, same size, about a pound, pound and a half. Hey, I'll take it. The scale isn't even off from the last one. That's always the good part when you can do that. This one's a female too. Getting up here to get her feet thing on. Look at that, 1.847, like I said. Get old girly back in the water and let her go, let her grow and make some more babies. There's one. Hopefully it's a bass and not a northern. Oh yeah, it is. Just a littler guy, but hey, today, with the day I'm having, I better weigh him because you never know. One pound, eight, 1.08 pounds. So, to that I say bon voyage, buddy. There's a whole school of bass right ahead of me. Wow, there's so many bass up in here. Time to go to Old Faithful. That's right, the Wacky Rig Yum Dinger. Catches them all the time. Hopefully, I can catch some of these bass that are just kind of floating around here. I got a few looking at it right now. There's one. Just a little guy. Probably one of the smallest ones that's actually up in here. We'll just get him off real quick and hopefully go for one of the better ones. Oh, I think I had him too. They just will not hit it. There's one. Hopefully one with some kind of size to it. Northern, are you kidding me? I'm in a creek full of bass and I hook into the one Northern in the whole thing. God. I hate these things. I hate these things. Did I ever tell you guys I hate these things? Quick little, I don't know, probably uh, half hour or so, maybe a little bit longer to cool off and just chill out. So now we're gonna see if all the bass I saw in here are ready to bite or not. Again, not a giant, but hey, today I have to weigh pretty much whatever I can get. So, total is uh, not even a pound, 0.99. Well, I just deleted the whole weight for today. So, scratch however much weight. I'll go back and add it up when I uh, am editing the video, but yeah. 0.99, we'll figure out however much weight I end up with. Not much, I'm guessing. If I hit, I don't know, I'm probably close to six with four fish, so it's not a good day so far. That's the first fish on the new reel, though. Hey, handle that thing like a champ, even though it was only like 10 inches and it didn't even fight. Alright guys, so that's the day. It wasn't exactly the day I was hoping for, but it's at least a day of fishing and I at least got to catch some bass. Uh, yeah, if you go the closest to guessing the weight, you're going to be, you know, in whatever video comes out next after this video is uploaded, which is probably going to be in a couple of videos. But anyways, 
go be in that video. And all I want to say is thank you guys for watching today's video. Uh, if you guys are wondering what exactly I was using to catch the fish, maybe you didn't catch it in the video, catch what I was catching them on. I was using a spinnerbait, a white one. I probably could have caught more fish had I had a little bit more natural looking spinnerbait on there. I found that little like channel that has just a ton of bass inside it. So every time I come out here from now on, I know that there's going to be fish inside that. I'm expecting them to spawn up in there, so be expecting a video or two of me fishing up there again. If you have any advice as to what exactly I could have done today, maybe, you know, I got some Bass Pro Tour guys watching this video. Let me know down in the comments what I could have done a little bit differently to maybe have possibly caught a couple more fish. And uh, yeah, if you guys, like I said at the beginning, haven't subscribed, you might want to just because I plan to catch a lot more fish and a lot better fish than I did today this year. And I pl plan to upload even more videos. So if you guys are wanting to watch some fishing videos, I know there's a ton of us out there on YouTube that are watching, well, that are making these videos you might want to jump on board with the whole Dom Trump fishing fan because we are going to be taking over YouTube surpassing first pig patrol that's our first goal then we got fishing more so be all them guys and then we're going for the Google squad we're taking over YouTube we're taking over this whole platform we are going to be the number one channel on this YouTube platform but without further ado I'm going to get this boat loaded up I'll see you guys in the next video whenever that may be make sure to hit that like button and also also get out fishing because there's no excuse anymore. none I'll see you then